We get a lot of uh, emails about equipment and one of the things people want to know is should they buy a Vitamix, uh, what it can do for them and I just want to show you a couple of quick things that we use the Vitamix for that makes raw food really fun. Um, here I have a little bit of flaxseed and it's dry, it hasn't been soaked and I'm just going to put it in here, put it in there dry just like that. Check this out. Flour. Flax flour. And we can use this to make crackers and breads and pizza crust, um, things like that. It's a real good binder. So there's one reason you'd want to use one. And just swish it out. Right into the sink. And now I'll show you how to make cocoa powder with uh, raw cacao nibs. And you can see that they're uh, just little chunks. They're really hard. Cacao nibs. Alright. Throw those in the Vitamix. Look at the uh, look at the lid. Cocoa powder. That probably made a lot of noise. Let's just take a look. You can use this in desserts. You can make uh, chocolate shakes. I think I hold the record for four in one day because <laughs> they're so good. Now, normally I would uh, just clean that out, but what I'm going to do right now is make a nut milk. And I just have some cashews here. Um, cashews are one of the nuts that you don't really have to soak. Um, I'm just going to put that in there. And when you're making uh, a nut cream, which is what I'm going to do, you just put a tiny little bit of water. We'll make chocolate nut cream. If you've been to uh, my website, whatisrawfood.com, you've seen the pie. This is how we do it. <laughs> mm. Okay. We just took hard nuts. and made cream.